Winona State University will make grief counselors available following the death of a sophomore. Hannah Goldman died yesterday afternoon. A suspected drunk driver going the wrong way hit the car she was in. Fox 9's Bab Santos spoke with her grieving family and has this report. One day after her life was stolen in a horrifying crash near the campus of Winona State University, Hannah Goldman's brother and mother are torn apart by the fact that the 20-year-old is no longer with them. Well, you don't think it won't happen to you because it did and it ruins a lot of people's lives. The crash happened just after midnight on Saturday morning. State Patrol saying a suspected drunk driver was driving the wrong way here on Highway 61 when his truck smashed into a Toyota Camry. When you do something like that, you're not just putting yourself or the people in your car in danger. You're putting... <laughs> you're putting everybody else around you in danger. You just took away a life of a vibrant, funny, loving, smart, wonderful, soon-to-be 21-year-old that nobody can come to grips to. Hannah was one of three people in the Camry. All three were rushed to a local hospital but only two will survive their injuries. They're both extremely in shock, extremely broken up. In the truck, a 35-year-old Winona man and his passenger were not injured. Now, the driver is behind bars on pending charges of fourth degree DWI and criminal vehicular operation. Don't make one stupid decision that can affect literally a whole community. It's just not right. It's not fair. Described by family as a happy and outgoing girl, Hannah was a regular volunteer at a homeless shelter in Winona, always with a smile on her face and always trying to make people laugh. She was just loved by many, and I'm glad that he got to touch as many people as she did. Reporting in Winona, Bab Santos, Fox 9.